Right, morning all. Monday the 15th of April. A nice sunny day. So what we've got planned for today is I've got the bike loaded up. I've got the tent on the back so we're going to head over to Worcester to my local campsite, Millhouse. Uh, they've agreed to let me set up the tent. So I'm going to set up this new regatta four-man tent and we're going to send the drone up and video from above of me setting the tent up. I'll probably do it in time lapse actually just to speed it up and then what we'll do we'll actually time how long it takes to get that tent set up and we'll see if we can get the bike in the porch. So let's try and get some fuel. And we've also, I've done new brake pads on the bike. So, it'd be good to get these bedded in. They feel quite sharp already. But spring is here. And it's the Easter week. And we've got a little mini heat wave coming. So they reckon for next weekend, it's going to be around 20, 22 degrees. Now I'm going to be in Western Supermare for that week uh, with the kids, so we might have to do a bit of beach action, I think. I think I might have to get my mankini on. Right, let's go and get some fuel. Yeah, what I'm going to try as well now, I've got my phone mounted there. I've kind of modified a bit of a GoPro bracket, because my phone was normally down here, and obviously when I'm riding I have to keep doing this to see the map. But what I want to do is I want to be able to just drive and look down and there's my sat nav. So a bit wobbly but we'll see. We'll see how it bounces along. Right, let's have let's have some music. We've also got coming up on the 28th of April we've got the Bike for Life ride at Cosford Air Force Base for the air ambulance. Done it a couple of years now and it's always a good turnout. There's normally three to four thousand bikes in convoy. Last year I think Carl Fogarty led us. Um, I believe this year we've got Carl Fogarty and Ron Haslam leading the road. Well my phone case seems to be holding up. It's a bit wobbly. But that is the perfect angle for me to see. I can actually drive like that. And I haven't even got to move my head. I can actually see the screen. Where before it was down there. So I'm happy with that. We just need to make sure it stays there. Right, music. Right, so here we are. We're now coming up to Mill House caravan and campsite. Been coming in here now for probably coming up to 30 years. We're here tomorrow actually in the caravan but I thought I'd come down today and set the tent up. Bill House, caravan site and boatyard. <laughs> Anywhere? Right then, so we are going to go and set up a tent. I'll tell you what, we'll go right down the bottom out of the way. That's my pitch over there, that's where I normally camp. So what we'll go down in the nice secluded corner. Just 
tell you what, this will be perfect, I think. Yeah. This will do it. Be nice and secluded. Right. Let's make a start. Where's my puck? Get that down. Okay, we are here. Yes, I'll be down here tomorrow in a caravan. For the family, this will be absolutely full this weekend, be it Easter. There'll be kids everywhere kicking balls. There she is. Don't she look nice in a field? Doesn't she look nice? Right, so this is what we're going to do. We're going to have a coffee first. Got my boots off. I brought my trainers with me. So what we're going to do... With the camera we're going to record. There's the tent. So, I'm going to set the timer. I'm going to send the drone up to film from above and I'm going to see how long it takes me to get this tent up. I'm going to have the, the timer running at the same time. So there she is. Well, this is what I've had to do with the bike. Right. Because the ground's still quite soft, I put my puck down and the bike's still sinking. So, I've had to use my coat and lean my bike up against the post. Just so it don't sink. Well, we'll have a coffee. Then we'll get this set up. See how long it actually takes me. Because this is the tent I'm going to be using. I'm going to be using this tent in Snowdonia and at the Walbad weekend. I won't use it in the Isle of Wight because we're only there for the one night so I'll use just a small tent for that it's nice and bright so let's see what we can do
point. So here we are. Tent set up. So this is the tent we've got. And it is called the Regatta 910. Regatta four man family tent with large living. So let's have a look at the sizes. Right, the size. So width is 320 centimetres, so 3.2 metres across. Bedroom compartment is 210 centimetres, so 2.1 centimetres deep, and each compartment is 150 centimetres, a metre and a half wide. The total length from the front to the back of the tent is 4 metres. The highest point here, standing up, is 200 centimetres, 2 metres, and 190 centimetres in the bedroom, 140 centimetres at the back of the bedroom. So for me, and my tiny little legs, that is more than enough. So let's have a coffee. So we are done. We've set up, we've tripped over, we've put the drone up, we've packed it away. Bog sticking over a bit quick. Okay, let's go.